When a patient needs to undergo surgery, it can be worrying and difficult to understand. So in this video, I'm going to give you the right phrases to use so you can explain and reassure. Hello, I'm Jo from Specialist Language Courses. We are the world's leading medical English provider. Do check out our website. We've got a range of courses to help you with your medical English so you can succeed in your career. And make sure you stay to the end of the video because we've got a gift for you. Let's begin. What phrases could you use to tell a patient that they need surgery? Look at these. Which one do you think is better? And this is the most appropriate phrase. Let's take a look at some more phrases you can use to tell a patient they need surgery. We need to do a procedure called a gastroscopy. I'm afraid we're going to have to do an appendectomy. Unfortunately, the only option left to us is a colostomy. I'm afraid you need to undergo an angioplasty. And you might need to explain what it involves by using phrases such as these. So we can look inside your stomach, remove your appendix, where we insert what we call a stent, repair the fracture, to remove, stitch or examine. So if we need to explain an appendectomy, for example, we could say, I'm afraid we're going to have to do an appendectomy so we can remove your appendix. Let's take a closer look at what you might say during an explanation of an appendectomy. Look at this scenario. You are talking to the father of a seven-year-old daughter who has a perforated appendix. Read the roll card and think of some phrases you might use. Now, look at these phrases 1 to D. Can you match them to the tasks? And here are the answers. I'm afraid your daughter has a perforated appendix and we need to do an emergency operation. We're going to do something called an appendectomy where we remove the appendix. Are you happy for us to proceed? Unfortunately, this is the only option left to us. Without surgery, your daughter will likely develop serious life-threatening complications. I understand you are worried, but let me reassure you that your daughter will be given a general anaesthetic so she will not feel any pain during the procedure. Want to know more about explaining surgery and how to pronounce the medical terms? Why not check out our courses? Imagine your patient has to undergo a gastroscopy. Let me know how you'd explain it in the comments below. And congratulations on getting to the end of the video. We've got a free handout for you. Simply write surgery below and we'll send you a link. And if you want to continue learning more about this topic, why not check out this video on surgical procedures. See you next time. Bye bye. Let's take a closer look at what you might say during an explanation of an appendectomy. Of an appendectomy. Of an. Let's take a closer look of what you might say during an. I'm afraid we're going to have to do an appendectomy. I'm afraid we're going to have to do an appendectomy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm afraid we're going to have to do an appendectomy. An appendectomy. An appendectomy. Of course I chose appendectomy. <laughs> and congratulations on getting to the end of the video. Is that right? The right way around? Yes.